Sunny, beautiful day in San Antonio. I've been here for a couple days now. It's the first time that I've opened my vlogging camera. I've just been catching up with friends and everything. On our way to the gym. Let's hit some upper body. Oh my gosh. Ah! <laughs> I just started taking, oh my god, Volt instead of C4. It's like Neon's pre-workout. And the beta alanine is just like, <laughs> like on my face. I love a beta alanine kick, so I'm totally cool with it. Because C4 isn't, I've been taking it so long, it just doesn't really hit me as hard anymore. I still get really good work off, off, off of it, I just don't get like the itch. Oh my gosh, it's just like on my face right now, like, <sighs> ha! <laughs> okay, we're gonna go kill some upper body today. I do a shoulder and back day, and then my uh, just a full upper body day, which is more like chest and arms. Um, I'll also do a little shoulders as well. I, I had to, I didn't hit rear delts on my last shoulder day, so I'm gonna do that. And that's what we're doing right now. Just thought I would finally vlog some. I haven't eaten yet. I just kind of woke up, kind of. It's 12:45. But I'm gonna have a quest bar before I work out so I'm not starving during it because if I get too hungry then I feel weak and then I don't get a good workout. So I'm gonna eat that before and then I'll probably show you what I eat for the rest of the day. And coming up here I'm going to do a full day of eating but I'm gonna do it like clean eating styles to show you that you can like count macros and eat clean at the same time if you so desire. Anyways, I'm rambling now. <laughs> I'm super pre-worked out so I took that on an empty stomach and I'm ready to fuck and rock and roll, bitches! What are you playing? Let's see if we can find a good one. The CMG Especially when it has like lots of chocolate chunks in it. So today I'm going to take you through a um, kind of full upper body day workout. We focus mainly on chest, arms, and a little bit of back and shoulders. So first exercise, Danae and I, my friend, um, superset all of these exercises. So the first two, we started with these uh, dumbbell tricep extensions. Hold the dumbbell behind your head. Um, focus on only moving past your elbow, like your forearm up and down, and flexing the tricep at the top and bottom. So those are really nice. I haven't done them in a really long time with the dumbbell. I typically do them with the cable ropes. So we superset those with some incline dumbbell curls. These, I was inspired by that recent video on Christian's channel, <laughs> flexing my tricep at the bottom. And uh, these hit the biceps really well. It's a really good like isolation movement. It kind of hits all parts of the bicep. I feel it um, and gets you really sore the next day. So that's Danae doing these. Um, we made that a superset. The next two exercises we did are both shoulders. So we did uh, upright rows with a 25 pound plate. Uh, did about 15 to 20 reps of these, I want to say. Um, but they're really nice for that little, uh, for your traps a little bit because I think bodies look weird if you don't have any trap muscles whatsoever so I do like to throw in an exercise that hits those every once in a while and that's why I do upright rows and I threw it in with a plate today just for like a, a hand grip closer together just kind of hit um, little different points there and that was super set with these rear delt flies which are obviously for your rear delt um, muscles your rear delt muscle and these are really challenging I always do them standing just so I can get the right positioning there's Danae doing them here. Um, but yeah, really good rear delt isolation movement. I always do them with this or with the dumbbells kind of bent over, but I find that this is a little easier and you can focus more on that muscle. After that, we went ahead and did our chest movements, our chest and triceps. So we did a bench press and then that was done with a um, tricep bench dips with a weighted plate. So we superset those, kind of did them together. There was just that one bench available for bench dips. We went ahead and did those simultaneously and then swapped, uh, superset those exercises. Um, really enjoyed that for the tricep work and for a little bit of chest. We do one more chest exercise, superset with these actually, these chin-ups. 
or neutral grip pull-ups. Um, I want to do these because I have a full day where I do back and lats and things like that. So I really wanted to do chin-ups because you get a lot of bicep action in there. Um, and it's just a different grip for your pull-ups. Different muscles hit. And I really enjoy them. They are very challenging. Um, those were super set. As I said, with one more chest exercise, we did these uh, cable chest flies slightly at a decline as you're pulling forward just to hit. Um, I like when I do chest, I like to do... Um, a like press and then something else like a fly with the dumbbells or with cables sort of more at a decline and then ideally an incline as well but that's going to conclude the workout footage hope you all enjoy the rest of the video some protein pancakes i have one serving of the bisquick shake and pour buttermilk pancake mix and i'm doing one scoop of our way this is the cinnamon squirrel cellulite core protein So I've been noticing that my waffles have been coming out kind of dry, so I'm going to add some Greek yogurt. This one, this is the Activia, um, the light, fat-free Greek strawberry. But I'm not gonna, the strawberry stuff's at the bottom, I'm just not gonna add the strawberry stuff. I don't know if that's weird. You see, I just left all the strawberry gunk at the bottom. And that is our stack of pancakes, and they're way thicker and fluffier than usual because of the yogurt, so I'm really excited about them. You want a pancake, Andy? Do you want a pancake, Faith? What about you, Billy? No pancakes for you. Bye about it. Last but not least, we came back to the gym for round two on this day, and Danae and I did some um, high intensity interval training. We did it on the bike, and then we also did it later with the rope. So I'm just gonna go ahead and let you um, watch this raw footage. And yeah, thank y'all so much for watching. What's your heart rate at? 184. Nice. 